Welcome to the Upper Biology Lab here at Maryville University. My name's Alistair Pringle, and I'll be taking you on a short tour of the, the lab and the capabilities we have. This is a biological safety cabinet. Uh, we use this for growing mammalian cells. We do that by using sterile pipettes and sterile flasks, and we'll inoculate those with media and with the cells, and then we'll put them in a cabinet to grow them. So once we've inoculated our mammalian cultures, we bring them over here and put them in this incubator. And to look at them, we put them under an inverted face contrast microscope uh, where we can view the progress. What I have here is a uh, thermocycler that we're going to use for PCR. Um, and you can think of this as a photocopier for DNA. So we can start with one piece of DNA and end up with a billion in, within two hours. Okay, so once we've amplified our D DNA in the thermocycler, what we want to do is see if we c we've been successful in amplifying certain bands. And so what we use is a gel electrophoresis apparatus. And what we do is load our samples into these wells. So once we have our samples loaded in here, we attach it to a power supply and put an electric field across it. Uh, by doing that, uh, we're going to have the DNA, which is negatively charged, move towards the positive terminal. And the larger fragments are going to move slower than the smaller fragments, so we'll create a series of bands based on the size of the fragments. Here I have the gel that's been run. I can put it in a gel visualizer, shut this drawer, and then it will visualize what's on the gel using UV light. So another thing we can do with the DNA we've amplified is sequence it. And in this lab, we have a min-ion sequencer. Uh, this is a third generation sequencer. Uh, and what we're able to do is detect each of the, the bases of the DNA in sequence, and then take that data and be able to blast it to the NCBI database where we can identify what gene it's from. It's been a pleasure to show you around the Upper Biology Lab and show you all our capabilities at Maryville. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out and contact us. I look forward to seeing you on campus in the near future.